Welcome to the annual dedication of this year's Blackbird's Eye and Talon Yearbook. At this time, I'd like to introduce Owen Williams, Caroline Acker, and Luke Harper to present the Blackbird's Eye dedication. This year's Blackbird's Eye is dedicated to a member of the faculty who has served O'Neill for 25 years. His peers regard him as exemplifying the true definition of a gentleman to her student body, displaying qualities of kindness, honor, and courtesy, and giving promise to the thought that chivalry is not dead. His depth and knowledge of the disciplines within the humanities are profound. His teaching career at O'Neill started in 1998 teaching English and AP English, eventually switching to history, teaching AP US history, AP US government, intro to economics, and comparative government. He received his bachelor's degree in English from UNC Chapel Hill, where he also worked as a newspaper reporter. He later earned his master's degree in English from NC State University and taught English on the junior college and university levels for several years. He completed his doctoral degree in English in 2005 from the University of South Carolina at Columbia. In the words of famous Danish author Hans Christian Andersen, where words fail, music speaks. This rings true to our honoree, who is also an avid drummer and finds immense joy in playing classic and progressive rock. His love and dedication to percussion is supreme. Finding great pride and value in showcasing the literary work of our students, over his 25-year tenure at O'Neill, he has orchestrated the publishing of our annual Blackbird's Eye and serves on the committee to select the Bill Young Klaus Creative Writing Award winners. Despite his diligent and vigilant oversight of our school's literary magazine, this dedication escaped his watchful eye. It is an honor to dedicate this year's Blackbird's Eye to Dr. Chris Miller. Where is it? Thank you, Caroline. Oh, oh. We'll get them later. Again, congratulations. It is now time to recognize this year's Young Klaus Creative Writing Award winners. The Bill Young Klaus Creative Writing Award was founded to honor Mr. Young Klaus, who was an avid writer himself. The prize is awarded each year to one lower, one middle, and one upper school student whose poem or prose is exhibited in the Blackbird's Eye. At this time, I'd like to call the three division heads forward to present this year's awards. The lower school winner of the Young Klaus Award this year is third grader Knox Jackson for his poem, <laughs> The Snow. The middle school winner of the Young Klaus Award goes to fifth grader Titus Cavanis for his short story, Bigfoot. In the upper school, 10th grader Charlotte Mills was chosen to receive the Young Klaus Award for her poem, Summer Into Winter. And now we'll turn the podium over to the Talon yearbook staff for their dedications. 
Before I speak about the 2022-2023 yearbook, I'd like to recognize all the people who helped make this yearbook possible. Our yearbook staff worked hard this year and our yearbook wouldn't be complete without them. Thank you, staff members. This year, we wanted to showcase the O'Neill community, which is why this year's talent theme is One O'Neill. No matter your grade, what sports you play, or what clubs you join, everyone here has something special in common. You are a member of the O'Neill community. We chose to represent this theme through watercolor to show how different colors can mesh together to create one unique look. This year, we created a more visual representation by letting the photos tell the stories of our school. Another special feature of this yearbook is the use of watercolors to represent each section of the yearbook, with it all culminating on the cover. This year, we added new sections that showcase student artwork from each division. We would also like to give a special thanks to Ms. Kathy Taylor and Ms. Wendy Hodges for the amazing photos taken this year. Your work is greatly appreciated. In addition to our yearbook dedication, we'd like to recognize certain members of the O'Neill community for their dedication. To say that Sam Amato is a beloved teacher in our middle school is an understatement. His kind disposition and genuine spirit has made students feel welcome and ready to learn. During his years at O'Neill, Mr. Amato has helped students prosper and cultivate their passion for academics. For the people who've had him as a teacher, his cheerful class environment and enthusiastic lessons have created many happy memories. Thank you, Mr. Amato, for 22 years of dedication at O'Neill. We know your next chapter will be amazing. A part of O'Neill's 12-year club, Ms. Blanche Hancock reminds us that you can always come home again. Mrs. Hancock is not only a member of the class of 88, but also has served the O'Neill community with her work in Bradshaw Hall, keeping our alumni connected. Thank you, Mrs. Hancock, for your dedication to O'Neill and our alumni. We wish you every success in your future and we fully expect to see you at every alumni function. A lot can happen in 50 years and Ms. Jan Simmons has been here to see it. When we celebrated her 40th year anniversary, Mr. Elmore said, it's people like Ms. Jan who run the school and give it meaning in life. Mr. Elmore was right. We would like to recognize Ms. Jan for her 50 years of service to the O'Neill School and for brightening our halls all the while. Thank you, Ms. Jan. You're truly golden and here's to the next 50. It's my honor and pleasure to announce the dedication of the 2023 through 2023 O'Neill School Yearbook. This year's town is dedicated to someone who has been an essential member of the O'Neill community for 13 years. Aside from being a father and husband, this person is involved in many school activities, including coaching soccer, a social media sensation, featuring his whole family, leading the science department, and let's not forget his immense talents. He has helped spark students' passion for science and has helped students grow into intelligent and thoughtful people. His dedication and enjoyment of his work are reflected in his fun and engaging lessons, allowing students to learn in energetic fashion. This teacher is a fundamental part of the O'Neill community. And as this year's talent is dedicated to Mr. David Williamson. Thank you, Mr. Will, and all that you do. Thank you, Mr. Williamson, for everything you do and for truly representing our yearbook theme. Considering that your wife, Ranger Nancy, is now part of faculty and your children are students in the lower school, you and your family truly exemplify the meaning of One O'Neill. Yearbooks will be distributed in the library during lunch break. Please look for the area with your grade level sign on it. Congratulations, Mr. Will. Uh, well-deserved, 